Good evening, everyone. Welcome to tonight's Ugadi celebration. I'm Anvita. I'm Bonnie. And I'm Lily, and we will be your MCs for this evening. Today, we are here to celebrate this auspicious event. Ugadi is a festival that marks the beginning of a new year in the Hindu calendar. Yugadi is made up of two different Sanskrit words, yug meaning era, and adi meaning new beginning. Thus, Yugadi stands for new beginnings. The festival also holds a special place for the region as it marks the beginning of nature's annual cycle and the onset of the spring season. On this day, people start their new year by praying to God, hoping to start the new year with positivity. Today, to celebrate the festival, we have a program filled with performances of songs and dances, followed by a delicious dinner. So sit back, relax, sit back, relax, and enjoy the festive program we have for you tonight. Before we begin with our cultural performances, please give a round of applause as we have a few welcome remarks given to you by Santo Kumar. I'd say applause should be reserved for the end of it. So, Ugadi uh, Subhashekalu, uh, like Vani had mentioned, Ugadi literally means Yuga Adi, which is uh, beginning of uh, the Yuga, when Brahma is supposed to create the universe, including the earth. We are here to celebrate the uh, great Ugadi function with the wonderful people of Karnataka. Kannada Nadu Balajanda, Kannada Hadu Sri Ganda. So, uh, my Kannada journey started uh, with Saku Beku. So, uh, there's a joke uh, one of my uh, uncles said. There's a Tamil guy who's going to the uh, wedding, and then the person is serving him and he's asking Saka Beka, meaning like, you know, you want more or you had enough? Uh, so, the guy doesn't understand what he's saying. He's saying, Saka la kunjam, Beka la kunjam. <laughs> So I started there, then I was uh, reading uh, 30 days uh, to learn Kannada from Tamil. Then uh, the thing is when I was uh, reading something, you know, Sundar, Sundaravada Kudigiru. Then my mother-in-law was looking at me, <laughs> like, you know, what is he saying? Uh, and then uh, the uh, other thing, uh, you know, I was asking my friend's wife, uh, she knows Kannada, you know, uh, the thing is, you know, then uh, the book read Kannada. I read Kannada Madhu Madhura, you know, so she said no. Kannada Madhu Madhura. So, uh, you know, there's also pronunciation. So now, I've been living with Smriti for so many years, 25 years uh, to be exact. And then now you've been graduated to figure and guru. So, uh, so I have become total Kannadigan. Then my biggest attraction to Kannada language was, uh, you know, I'm interested in Carnatic music, so Purantra Dasa. He is considered the Pitamaha, our godfather of Carnatic uh, music. He started the Sparavali, Alankara, and then he introduced the Maya Malav Gaula Raga, uh, and then also Gita, uh, Gite. Uh, but uh, you know, there are some uh, famous songs he has composed. The uh, one which will be favorite of all men, uh, it goes like this. Hindati Pran Hindati. So, so, from that point on, I became a big fan of Purdura Dasa. Uh, jokes aside, I'll introduce Katesh Shari. He's going to give you the history of Ugadi celebration in Colombia. Thank you. Thank you, uh, Dr. Sentil, uh, for that uh, really uh, very illustrious uh, welcome remarks. Uh, with that last song, uh, I have to admire your guts. <laughs> so, um, welcome everybody. Yellarigyo, Yugadiya Shubhashaya. I just wanted to uh, dial uh, the time zone. Uh, 30 years back, uh, I'm seeing uh, lots of faces here, and I recognize a vast majority of you uh, were not even born by then. That is when, back in 1994, not too far away from this site, it was uh, 
the uh, clubhouse uh, in Broadway Village, um, the Ugadi, Colombia Ugadi celebrations started 30 years ago. So this is the 30th anniversary. We always believe in Indian mythology, something what we call as Chaitra Mahima. You know, lots of great things happen when you pray God and when you uh, have an objective uh, for your life, um, you do that uh, you know, in front of God, mostly in temples and so forth. So, uh, it's very interesting that uh, if you want to be uh, in Colombia or if you have desires to do something that is embedded with longevity, embedded with uh, values, uh, including spiritual values. Consider doing that here in Colombia. It is, it is almost guaranteed that it will happen year after year, day after day, at least for 30 years. So here we are, after 30 years, celebrating this Mughali. So I just want to recognize uh, people who were there in that first ever uh, event. Uh, we had uh, uh, our uh, really uh, the, the, the tremendous leadership what we got 30 years ago that continues as of today. We had Veera and Chandra. We had uh, we had uh, Raghu and Sandhya Pondrangi. We had Lakshman Kartwa and Geeta Kartwa. We had uh, Pramila and Dabir Vishwanath. And we had Kavita and Lysa. Oh my goodness. Krishna and Sanjay. By the way, Krishna and Sandhya, we were in the exact same apartment complex. That is not 30 years ago. It goes back to 34 years ago. So this is all about uh, you know, kinship. It's all about friendship. It's all about uh, mutual respect and so forth. So uh, 30 is an interesting number. Uh, it is uh, one of those numbers that you add those two digits you can divide that number by 30. So these types of numbers in the Sanskrit, they're called as Harsha. Harsha in Sanskrit, as all of you know, is joy. Ad in Sanskrit means give. So for the last 30 years, this occasion, this uh, cultural uh, extravaganza, has been giving joy to everybody in Colombia. So the 30th year is all about enjoying that joy again year after year and we are uh, here to, uh, to celebrate the 30th year anniversary. The group that I just mentioned, the group of those uh, uh, six families, there was a very strong significance to that group. We talk a lot in India about Vasudeva uh, Kutumba. Uh, this group signified that because this group hailed from Karnataka, from Andhra Pradesh, from other states. And this Vasudeva Kutumam concept has lived on. In fact, it has strengthened year after year. We continue to celebrate this Ugadi uh, almost in the, in the spirits of how uh, things were celebrated during Krishna Devaraya Kingdom. There was no difference between Karnataka and Andhra Pradesh and so forth. And this has lived on. So with these few words, again, I would like to welcome all of you for this cultural activities. Sit back and enjoy the, the, uh, the, the huge cultural art that we are about to present. Thank you.